My name is Nadeem Tahami. I'm a consultant hepatologist. I'm in company of Ms. Shabana Begum. She's South Asian Outreach Officer working with Hepatitis C Trust. She's also leading the campaign against Hepatitis C of awareness and testing in community centers in South Asian community. Hepatitis C has prevalence of 2 to 4% in South Asian community and it is therefore extremely important that we run a successful campaign and identifying those patients who needs to be treated so that we can eradicate this virus from UK. I would like to ask Ms. Shavana Begum to introduce Hepatitis C Trust and all the efforts that she and her team has put in in raising this uh, awareness. Thank you so much Dr. Tamani. Um, my name is Shavana Begum and I work for the Hepatitis C Trust as the South Asian officer. The Hepatitis C Trust is a national charity and they have an office based in London. Because it's a national charity, um, I cover the whole of the country in my role, uh, covering mosques, community centres, Asian festivals, wherever there are pockets of South Asians within the UK, um, I will go there and uh, raise awareness and promote testing in the communities. So can you please let us know what the future plans are for Africa C in um, raising this awareness campaign further? We've already covered a variety of mosques around the country. Um, we've done Asian festivals. We have all, um, been approaching community centres as well and raising awareness within the community centres, within the community setting itself. So I basically go in, um, put up a stand for information, deliver talks, uh, presentations and then have focus group meetings as well. So still trying to find out what it is that we need to do to try and engage more people. In the I, I believe you offer testing um, in, in this, these events as well. So could you please tell us a bit more about that? Right, okay. The testing that we actually do are our own mouth swabs and we, what we do is we take, um, we get the person that's doing the test itself to take the test and swab the insides of their cheeks because we only need a few cells then that is actually put into an activating solution and it takes 20 minutes for the results because it's quick and easy and the simplicity and the speed of the testing itself people well the general public right are very happy to have the testing done in that community settings for example on friday prayers is the best time that we actually go to a mosque you'll have hundreds of people there that attend the Friday prayers and what we do is we promote awareness that we are attending the event two weeks prior to actually being there. So we set up 10 o'clock in the morning and we're there till 4 o'clock in the afternoon. We have we test around uh, you could say between 50 to 100, 150 people but we actually get to engage with a good couple of hundred people. And can you also elaborate some of the transmission routes? You call the local barber into the house when a newborn baby is born. He would have performed the procedure for circumcision and head shaving. And if he has not sterilized the equipment between clients, it's more than likely he would have transferred the virus to a very innocent baby. And how do you go about organizing these events? So who helps out with these events? I approach Public Health England. I get them on board. Uh, they again get in touch with the local hospitals, the local GPs, they do all the advertising for us. So it's a massive campaign, but then we have to make sure that there are um, pathways for them as well, for the patients that have tested positive for the antibody test, so we don't lose anybody in the process. And that the patients do like to talk to me. We have a helpline with the Hepatitis C Trust, which is actually manned with ex-patients. And uh, obviously, having the experience of being through the treatment itself and the you know, dealing with the virus and the stigma, it helps the patients on the other end of the line to know this and they are then confident enough to talk about their problems as well. And today I think we have tested or engaged with people, near enough eight to 9,000 people. We are grateful um, for your effort and Hepatitis C Trust efforts. It is important that we take this message out there to our community to raise this awareness further as we have treatments available these days which can achieve cure in up to 90% of the cases. We would refer you to our website, uh, Hepatitis C Trust website, 
uh, where you can find more information. Thank you so much for having me here today and giving me this opportunity. Um, I would like to say that um, if anybody else needs any contact details, please go to our website, which is www.hepcitrust.org.uk. Thank you.